Ukraine's president Petro Poroshenko has held talks with his Polish counterpart Andrzej Duda, who came to Ukraine on a two-day official visit for the first time. During the visit, Poroshenko announced that Poland has offered a $1 billion credit line to Kiev. That comes as part of an agreement on currency swap arrangements between the central banks of Poland and Ukraine. Negotiations between the head of Ukraine's central bank, Ms. Gontareva, and the head of the Polish central bank, Mr. Belka, have been held. Agreements have been reached. I was informed of that by the head of the central bank, and we assist in all possible ways for the opening of a credit line swap for the amount of 4 billion zloty or 1 billion euro. And it, without a doubt, will contribute to commerce between Ukraine and Poland. Both presidents also spoke out about the Nord Stream 2 project, a plan to build a gas pipeline between Russia and Germany, which circumvents Poland and Ukraine. Ladies and gentlemen, it is not an economic or business project. It is a political project, a project which interferes in a substantial way with the energy security of our countries, and that is why there is no way we can accept it. And we will raise this issue in every possible and available forum. So I am grateful to Mr. President Poroshenko that he added his voice to the words of determined protest against what is, in my opinion, a harmful investment and also for the European Union. Duda, who is also meeting students and members of the Polish diaspora on his visit, said Poland will provide financing for border infrastructure and information exchanges as part of Ukraine's anti-corruption reforms. Warsaw has been one of the most outspoken critics in Europe of the Kremlin since Russia annexed Ukraine's Crimean Peninsula in March 2014 and began supporting militants in East Ukraine.